You alright, Tree Slayer? I'm dying. Sounds like it could. Well, that ain't, that ain't very positive, you know. <laughs> Must be outside the gate, huh? Yeah. Here, talk to Cosmo. He's supposed to be here in like a second. At least that's what he said. It's been more than a second. I figure I might as well get my fat ass down to the trader before uh, shit starts going crazy. Yeah, I still don't even know where that is. It said it's along this dirt road, but... Yeah, it's just straight. No, you're totally good on that bitch. You killed right. here at the gates twice, bro, so... <laughs> do I what? know how it feels. I'm not gonna do yeah. that. <laughs> but, uh, but, yeah, just uh, feel free to just kind of like chill. Kind of in the corner here. Uh -huh. Take a little. See that? Bro, I didn't even realize that your car had like froze, and we were just sitting there watching it. And yeah. Like, oh, said, uh, don't move. Don't move. Don't move. <laughs> Can you get the other one for me? Uh, Mr. Yeah, Grant, how long have you been on the server? Uh, since last weekend. Last weekend? Okay. I think yeah. I don't remember seeing you here. All right. You interested in joining the community? Yeah, 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 for sure. Alright, walk walk ahead of me and follow him inside, would you please? Oh my god! Oh shit, he's coming! Hurry! Careful! <laughs> I'm, I'm hold on, hold on, I'm almost there. Alright. Oh, we need that other one open too. Fuck this shit. I know. What did you want to do here? Did you want to just be a, a settler? You know, did you want to work in public works, uh, be a medic, guard, police officer? You know, what what uh, what, you, what is your interest here? Or do you well, just want to kind of sit and hang your hat? Well, uh, Johnny there, come at me yeah. with an opportunity that I kind of do mm -hmm. like that kind of stuff in real life. They said there's like one him and one other person that does the fishing in this main lake over here. I'd be uh, interested in oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. helping supply fish around here. For real. Okay. Alright. Good deal. Johnny, <laughs> would you do me a favor then and take him down to Hippie Lake and uh, see uh, you know, see what's what? You better believe it. Yeah. Show him, show him the goods. I'll you you better here. believe it. Yes. Uh, no, no. I, I, I got all the locks on me, so I'll just do it. You guys do. Let's go, boys. I'm, I'm gonna stand way over here. All right. Oh my God. Let's hey. Hey. Oh, where are you going? You going in here? I'm gonna get up here. Take off, man. Don't hit the thrusters, yeah. man. All right. Nice and slow, dude. Just ease into, ease into some seconds. Yeah. Like spit on it first. I am in seconds because I don't want to go too fast. But the Cosmo, you piece of shit. You bought that truck. I bought two trucks. <laughs> Yo, 
Uh -huh. Spit on it once or twice. We're not going like that. No, not yet. I wouldn't. Come on. Hold on. Don't lock that outside gate. Right. Do not lock that gate. Don't lock that gate. Do not. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Johnny. Thank you so much. All right. We're out of here, boys. We're going straight here. We're going to be good. What? Uh, you're not coming back, are you? I put it in a little bit. Regular trader. Regular trader. Oh, what do oh, you what? need? I, I, dude, hold on, I'm lagging bad, dude. Like, I was like, rocking. Right, hold on. Just like, just I was under rolling. the map for 0.2 seconds. Just shoot it. Yeah. Hold on, field. I'm just gonna pull it over I here. Uh, I have that stuff here. Let me run and grab my order and then we'll just get you together, bro. Give me like this. Yeah. Uh, Yeah, 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 not a good idea. I was literally driving to Olga last night on the way up here. I yeah. lagged. I lagged. It yeah. hit a tree head on. Knocked me out. I woke up and it was fucking storming mm -hmm. like a motherfucker. It was like a bad movie scene. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Gee whiz. Oh, oh, hey, Costa, do you still have the two LAR Max I can buy off you? Like you talked about? Yeah, you can have them. I'm not gonna lie, man. I like it here, for real. Until nah, you see fucking hippie leg, bro. Alright, man, I'm following you. Let's go! Uh, when are you gonna start uh, selling out the beach to everyone's houses? You know, there's lots of work. You got a lot of back to beach houses. What up, Sean McFry? Long time no see! Hydrant right here. Water hydrant one of two. Uh, nice. Rocks. This is the only rocks that I know of in the settlement for flagpoles and ovens. Nice. Nice. I thought we wasn't supposed to put up flagpoles. Maybe there's another um, server. We're not. It's just you need one for for the maximum space to keep your stuff there. You know what I mean? So you can't put one up on every single building, but you can put one up like. Uh, until the next like zone is for the flagpole to end, you know what I mean? Alright, alright. So, um you run all the way down this this main road. This is called Lukow Street, which is the main street. Right. You run all the way down Lukow Street till you hit this little dirt road right here by this cabin. Yeah. You hang left. I already have, just getting in here, man. Seems like a great place. You know, and that's the thing, like, there's so many new people coming in here that I, I get I get lost track of the names. And, uh, I'm the kind of guy who, I, lo I love people, but I, I'm not really a huge people person, so it takes me a minute to just kind of, like, get to know somebody. Yeah. And, uh, it's hard. Welcome to Hippie Lake. Oh, man, this is beautiful. So, we have plans for the, the admin's going to spawn in a hunter cabin right here in the trees. Right. We have our little, uh, we have a garden plot right here next to the lake. I'm going to build a, uh, in the water right here, I'm going to build a fucking single story uh, wash tower kit. So it'll have a little dock. We can sit on the dock and fish. Nice. Have a campfire, shoot fireworks off the dock. Then you come around this side of the lake. And you have the, the bench and the boat, and then right above the bench and the boat, you have our little fishing shack where we're going to be keeping fishing hooks, fishing line, fishing lures, all stuff like that. Nice. Then we got our uh, our food barrel right here, food and water. I'm not going to lie, it's fucking cool. How in the hell do you get spawned into a tree? 
That's uh, that's amazing. crazy. That's crazy. And this is our tool tool barrel right here next to the shed, so we can build stuff. Nice. And then this right here, the blue barrel, is going to be our water barrel. So that's just collecting rainwater, and you can just uh, fill up a can. Now, the coolest part about this is once you talk to Cosmo and he says you're in, blah blah blah, which you obviously are. He just has to, I think, he just has to say it. You can tell him that you're going to take over the original building of the Lukau Fish Market. Yeah. So this is this is technically this is technically the headquarters of Lukau Fish Market right here. Right. And it's all built up, ready for somebody to move in here. Which, honestly, if you wanted this place, this would be a perfect place for you. I have a tent that you can start out with, get you a few barrels, get you a box in here, and uh, this can be your home. And you have your door right here that you can easily access the gate block from inside and outside. Nice. And you got nice. your own little garden garden plot right here. But then uh, the, the main Lukau fish market got relocated right here to, to this building by the haystack. And I kind of designed it so that uh, when people are around fishing the lake or if they need anything or if they're on this part of the, the map, they come right here, right? You come inside here and then voila, here's two barrels that have food and fish in them. That's cool. And, uh, That's some cool shit. So, like, do we sell the fish, me, or is it just like a yeah, community I mean, you giveaway can, thing? If, if people want to give 500 bucks for a fish, or if they just want it because they need it, then great. So, and like, this is, I'll give you access to all of this stuff inside here. The truck, there's a car to our left. There's tents back there. Nice. So, yep. Hell this yeah, is, man. Uh, it's very quiet. Very quiet. love it hell yeah man so like since that's the headquarters where 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 is the like the living quarters at so um living quarters is kind of up to you strictly i i i need to eat food um i'm choosing to kind of be just like a hermit and live inside the shed hey eat this eat um, this but there are <laughs> A lot better yeah, for there you. are plenty here. of houses um, available around the area right here. So yeah. I'll go run to the closest one. So this is an industrial area right in front of us. Right. Um, there's a big house up here that is actually actually this this house is free. It has two upper rooms and a bottom storage room. Nice. So you could always talk to Cosmo and say, hey, I noticed there's one house in the industrial. If that's all right, if it's not claimed, could I have it? And there's these two big rooms right here. And you can put some random storage in this clutter right here upstairs. And then you have a little entryway for like a barrel and random loot you find. So that's definitely a possibility because nobody's claimed it. So it's, it's free taking and then uh, you come over this way. Uh, there's some houses now straight in front of us that have been unclaimed and this is kind of the back the back end of the settlement if you if you think about it the settlement's kind of like a kind of like a bratwurst it's not long and skinny but it's kind of thick and blunt like and bratwurst. The, the bratwurst <laughs> <laughs> this I'm, is the end of the bratwurst I have never heard of a community being freaking uh, explain like a bratwurst. That's pretty damn funny. <laughs> and uh, you got three toothpicks in the, in the bratwurst placed sporadically, and those are the watchtowers. So, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is a cool little hub. Somebody already took this house right here, but these two houses right here are super nice. I love these little wooden houses. Yeah, so they always uh, have really nice loot spawn in them, and uh, they're just good looking houses. So. I need to change my boots real quick and take those ones on the ground. But, uh, so then if you were to move into one of these houses right here, you would live right next to the mayor's house, which is, uh, this piano house right here. And the mayor of, or the, uh, excuse me, the governor 
of the place is Rebel General. He's a really nice guy. Um, and I believe this house is still up for grabs. But once you kind of get over into this area, you're probably going to de be dealing with more people. So that's why, you know, maybe that house, that single house over in that industrial would be really good for you to yeah. have up while it's still yeah. open. Um, and just, just so you know, so right down the street from the governor's house, this, this garage right here, this garage spawns some insanely good loot inside here. I found one, one run over here, I found three pristine jerry cans full of gas in here. I think that's crap. I bet you that sells for a lot around here. Yep. So, um, and that's the nice thing about it right now, too, is it's still kind of quiet over here. So you can loot and just run around here and hunt chickens and pigs, and you won't see many people. Instead of going up towards the front of the bratwurst where everybody is living, then there's just a lot of people and a lot going on, which is fine. It just, for me, it gets to be a little bit much because you don't know who's talking and like oh who's that oh i don't know you good to meet you and then you meet 10 other people and it's like yeah oh my lord I'm, I'm overwhelmed so that's kind of why me and my friend killer hippie have moved over to the lake area over there because it's just quiet we uh we're getting fishing poles coming towards the settlement right now so we're gonna have huge stock we already have a really good stock inside that main fish trader house so nice it's uh, looking really fucking good. So once it, things kind of get get more in shape, we'll we'll start fucking cranking fish out. It's gonna be a lot of fun. And the the thing that I, I I think is gonna work best for me is I have severe depression and anxiety. So when when I'm talking to people and, and drama arises, which it always does when you have multiple people and multiple personalities and you end up being friends with that that person that's involved in the drama you get put in shitty positions sometimes right yeah and so the nice thing about being at the lake is you can choose when you want to run up to the front of the bratwurst and give people fish and you can choose when you want to leave and go straight back to fucking hippie lake because there's nobody saying that you have to be at the front talking to people, giving them fish, blah, blah, blah. For all anybody gives a fuck, you can be at the back of the lake and not fucking talk to anybody. So nice. that's the beauty of being back there. And that's, that's, what I, that's what I really needed on this game and what I was looking for. And Hippie and I found it last night and we had a fireworks show at the edge of the lake. It was just, it was spectacular. It was absolutely spectacular. That's my whole spiel. My mouth hurts from moving so much. Yeah, it was a mouthful for sure. Fuck yeah, and I don't usually talk that much, so I must be really stoned. <laughs> <laughs> nice. But uh, let's go. Let's go find good old Cosmo, and uh, you can uh, tell him everything you've learned and go from there. And then obviously um, that building right there, the big two-story one with all yeah. the windows on top, brown on the one, that's, that's the radio, sh radio shack, yep. And just beyond that with the smoke coming out of it, that's the, uh, the police station. That's kind of a little main hub and then right here is the hospital. That's where Sean, your buddy's at. Um, because I ran to Sean too, he killed me. He, I, I was his first kill on the server. <laughs> Yeah, uh, he teamed up with uh, just Kate, and uh, yeah, yeah, they cracked shots at us, but they didn't give us. Fuck yeah! So it looks like this is where the truck brigade ended. That means that good old Mr. Cosmo somewhere around here. If if he didn't leave, looks like everybody left. Alright, the funny thing about this settlement, dude, is that people just, it's like an ant farm. And people just run all around in the little tunnels, and you never know which tunnel somebody's in, but they're always in the farm. You know what I mean? There's a bunch of people up here to the right. We might be with is them. There? Yeah. There was, anyways. Okay, let's go. Yeah, that'll lead me to him. Uh, Probably where he is. 
Yep, so, uh, like I said a second ago, radio house on our left. <coughs> Police station with the fire cauldron right there. And then this way, you go through these double gates. This is uh, the area of the community trader. This, is, uh, this might be where they're at, too. I'm not sure. Yep. A pistol and a, a weapon kit. Wow. First off, or whatever. It's there to the gun dealer, or whatever he is right now. We do want smoke grenades. Smoke oh, grenades and flares. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, my bad. I didn't mean to do that. What'd you say? We smoke do grenades. want oh, yeah, smoke grenades pistol. and sure. flares. Flare guns as well. For sure. Yeah. And radios. My bad. My bad. No, I was trying to do this. Yeah, if, yeah. if you want to know exactly what gear we're rolling with, picture uh -huh. me wearing a uh, medical uniform and everything else I've got on. This, this is our gear. Okay. So smokes, flares, signal pistols for definite. Makes sense yeah. to me. Okay. Alright. Um, cool. In terms of vests, assault vest with butt pack. What, assault pack vest with butt pack? Helmet. Okay, yeah. gotcha, gotcha. As, right. as, uh, tack helmet with both attachments. Okay, alright. Gotcha, gotcha. Um, and yeah, that's... Not the high-vis vest? It, I was thinking the high-vis vest. Can't do much with no. it. But. Well, we'd probably get <laughs> shot, though. <laughs> it, get shot. Oh, you're, if you you're, have you're... the high-vis vest, you can't have the... You can't uh, have any attachments. ...assault vest. Also, with, the, good. with the assault vest, you can have two radios each. So if one fails, you've got a immediate backup. Yeah. Yep. Well, um, yeah, I've got radios for you guys. Oh, here, take this. Uh, I'm gonna try adding. Right. Okay. I'll test what blood that is. Oh, that's no, enough. It, it already... Cosmo. Yeah. Whenever you draw um, blood, it automatically tests it. Oh, cool. Um, I have got a barrel for a O negative blood, which is universal, and I've got another yeah. barrel which is going to be separate from everything else for any other type okay. of blood. Okay. So that, that's, right. that's just uh, keep everyone safe then. Sounds good to me. All right, let's get the flock out of here. We're outside. We're just patiently uh, waiting. <clears throat> the Cosmo. Hello? They might have ran the other way. They ran away. Yeah. They don't want to talk to us. It's on the beach. Hey, sounds good. Hello. Sounds good. Sounds good. I'm What's old, up, Jaddy? Your name's in. Hello. I gave um, him the skinny. You didn't give him the fat? You gave him the skinny? Jeez, Johnny. Yeah, it's always skinny, sorry. Um, he, he got oh, it either way. I might go do some running. Can I start now? But, uh, so, Cosmo, I meant to message you last oh, night, hey. but I was up till 3 a.m. and I didn't feel like bothering you with something super unimportant. But I just hey. moved the main fish market to that little shed just uh, next to that one know. that you saw me in with the tents. Uh-huh. Um, and I offered to up. Mr. Aaron here, if he wanted to, he could temporarily use that one that I originally was in as a temporary home, or he was looking at a house. Yeah. Right in that industrial area. Um, yeah, take him around because you'll still have to have a week here as a um, as a waiting for housing approval. You know what I mean? Yes. So take him around. Yes. You know, show him where you can he can make. You know, I want to make one of those fields a place where we can just plant like a tent or two. You know what I mean? Like a big tent or even a car tent. Yeah. I think I'd rather have a large tent because it looks better out there uh, that we can have like our as our waiting for housing area, our homeless shelters. You know what I mean? And uh, then we can well, do that for you, okay? We we, we want to have like a week waiting period on the server, a week waiting period within the server or within the settlement, and then you guys can go ahead and get to the house. All right, we just kind of to see how active you are, kind of you know things like that. All right. 
basically. But they can still hang out as a visitor, correct? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Actually, he's cool. not even a visitor. He's in between visitor and settlement. You know what I mean? Yeah. He's been on here for the server for a while. If he's interested in being here, he's, he's more than welcome to you. Before we uh, set him up with a home, he'll have to be here. So uh, by the next PvP time, next Friday, then, you know, if you if you found a home that you're like, I want this home, then we'll get you that home, okay? All right. All right, all right. All right, I'm going to do some more mayoral duties, and um, which uh, means I'm going to go take a shit. Get it, mayoral nice. duty. Uh -huh. one, one, one last little thing before you poo, sir. Yeah, I think. What's up? Um, I just sent you... Tool I so I can like, take all that shit down right the there. Handle. And then... Do the what? Um, tools oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. for... To, yeah. Tools handle, for my flag know, building like, mission. Yeah. And then... Helping that um, and it. Yep. Could I, could I grab barrels and then, could I build your homeless shelter with my large tent that I have? Um, what do you need barrels for? Well, you said barrels for what? Well, you know that, those two tents I have that you're like, oh, well, yeah. it's all the way out here, so maybe it's not too bad. I could take that yeah, large yeah. tent I have and use that as the homeless shelter. That right, and put a gate on top of it. Or break, oh, get, okay, get I've got to wait for yeah. admin to do it. Yeah, out in the all field, right. cause... Need also, also, uh, whenever you get yes. around to it, these gates can come down. You know what I mean? We don't okay. Need right. But yeah, yeah. Um, so whenever you get around to it. Main, main uh, thing there are tools. Now official runners. Yeah, yeah. Checking.
I'm back. Nice. Same. All right. Uh, which I will tell you, I do work second shift, so I get off here at one o'clock, one hour my time. That's fine. And uh, I'm also going on vacation next week. So yeah. So if there's anything I can like help with right now to speed up the process of you and your well-being, let me know. Look, yeah, thank you. I definitely will. There's not uh, a whole lot on my to-do list other than what I kind of just like talked about Cosmo with. And in order to do all of that fun stuff, I Hello. need tools to what up, bust Sean? all that stuff down. So. We've been into Sean. Long time no see. Hello. Hello. What's up, Sean? Hey. What you been into, Sean? Sorry? What you been into? Long time no see. Oh you know, just owning a hospital now. Hell yeah. Reckon As you do. Pretty cool. I'm homeless for a week. <laughs> Johnny, I do have a hatchet if you want to go ahead and get started. Alright, how do I. Where are you, Blue Prairie? They're logging in still, Sean, I'm sure. Oh, unless you're looking yeah. for him on the. Yeah, I'm waiting. It would be so much easier if I had an admin role. Because I'm waiting yeah. for an admin to give uh, my new recruits. The... You don't want that power, bro. I do, it makes life so much easier. It's tedious at the moment. I'll probably get <laughs> it. Uh, um, Heresy said, at the moment, it's just, you know, just want to get more trust with me so people don't have tantrums and lose their shit. Thinking, oh, he knew, why is he admin? Yada, yada, yada. Yeah, I've Fair been enough. here since the start, man. Yeah, so there's probably a few players like that that would just have tantrums that some new guy come in and suddenly admin. So, it's, you know, he wants to get trust first, which fair enough. I respect that. I just say because it would make like me I'm 23. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I've got to wait for an admin to grant them the badge icon. Um for medic so that I can then add them into the medic staff group so they know what the fuck they're going on a run to look for nice yeah. or if they're going on a run or what they're doing at the moment it, it's painful <laughs> it'd be easy if I could just like meet them sign it and then everyone fucks off to do what they're doing So, uh, I understand why I haven't got admin role, but I'll probably get it later down the line. Yeah, it's just tedious yeah. at the moment. Apparently, they've given uh, privilege to people before, and they've just been dickheads. Oh yeah, oh yeah. So <laughs> it makes sense. It fucks it up for everyone else, doesn't it? I literally got killed in the sediment walls just the other day, like three days ago. <laughs> Damn. I got shot I ran in across the someone face. with a a white armband in the settlement. Asked them if they were admin. They went, um yeah, something like that. Like, I'm half admin. I point my gun at um threatened to shoot him. They quickly took the armband off. Who was it? <laughs> Fuck knows, but I know they, he wasn't an admin. I know that because I, I speak to the admins. Build, um... I've, I've not met one of them, but everyone else I know. Uh, 
and I, I know the rules on killing, so I was just going to shoot him in the crotch. Ouch. Well, even that though, Sean, you gotta realize, even that though, when you shoot somebody, you automatically enable to give them the right to kill you. Yeah, but it, it so would have been justified. Because if yeah. you look in the rules, it does uh, space, yeah, specify if someone is intimidating a faction, admin, or anyone with an armband, they are liable to get shot. As the admins are not here, ah. I was taking it, you know. Look at you, Mr. Rule Guy. Well, no, I just read the rules. Don't forget, oh, I'm no, relatively I, I new, so it's still, still uh, in my head. All this stuff is like so new and to me as well, brother. Let's face it, I've been here just over a week, and already I own a hospital, which apparently you're not allowed to own. And I'm a bounty hunter. <laughs> oh, you just, yeah, you run the hospital. Yeah, I, I legitimately own it. The admin turned around and said, yeah, um... Uh, Pop said you can't have it. Well, you own it now. <laughs> Pretty much how it went. Well. Yeah. Hello. Hello. It's Gamoon. Gamol. I don't know. I, I'm just going to call you Mole because your name confuses me. Yeah, that's alright. Mole will do. <laughs> I'm going to go do some running, I think. Is that all good? Uh, what? Running randomly in a circle. I guess so. <laughs> Ned, get to go run, do some, get some med stuff. Oh, all right. Um, that my job. It is, that my it, employment. It is PVP weekend, so you're likely going to get shot very quickly and easily. Yeah. No, I got faith. See, isn't it nice being in the walls, Sean? Yes. Don't get me wrong, God. I am sending my boys out during purge uh, once we've got more numbers, but they are going to be heavily protected and wearing better gear and carrying less meds. I'm going to do it on a pay first. We'll try to get to you, but even if we can't, no refunds. It's going to be double. That's fucking on sweet. Purge. That's actually fucking sweet, Sean. That's well, sweet, dude. Usually, you gave me little shivers when you said we'll... that, bro. Nice work. Yeah. If, if we, if we <laughs> usually go, pay, no, if we usually charge two hundred <clears throat> during a week, on purge weekends it's going to be like four hundred, because the chance of us getting oh, shot yeah. and losing it is m over double. Like what? Quadruple the chances. You and zombies have on you top. Work it out for you. Holy shit. Well, I. Don't forget, I'm a, I am in charge of total four, uh, if you will, factions, so to speak. Like, there's my leadership, and then I've got runners, which are running around gathering supplies. Scouts, which will be going around looking for new players, anyone wounded, to help them. And then the medical protection uh, de uh, department part of it, which will basically be bodyguards, but also medics. <coughs> I figure since medics... I mean, look at him. He's soft and squishy. If you know he's going to be carrying a lot of valuable loot, who wouldn't want to shoot him? True. Whereas if yeah. he's got, like, four fucking heavily armed bounty hunter-looking motherfuckers surrounding him, you're going to have bigger problems. I don't know how you, you you would fare against four bounty hunters aiming their guns at you. <clears throat> I usually hide in the grass. Take out the back yeah. one. And work it up with a silencer. <coughs> it, it certainly makes you think twice, doesn't it? Yeah. Uh, it just depends. Like... Some people just join the server to die, so they're going to take out as many as possible with them. Yeah. That but happens I more am, than you'd like, gonna, too, I feel like. Yep. When we are uh, bigger numbers and closer to that point, I am going to make it clear to the admins, due to 
the amount of loot we're carrying and how big of a target we are. Yeah, if any of the guards do feel threatened, we will, you know, aim. Yeah, Obviously, we'll still you. give warnings. I know this from experience. When somebody figures out your loot pattern, they will start setting up booby traps. Exactly. That's why I want people like you who know this shit to be guarding them. Because the guard's job is basically go, right, we're going to this town. Okay, then we'll take this route. We'll cut here. Watch out for traps over this part, etc. There you go. The whole point of the uh, middleman is to be soft and squishy and not die. <laughs> <laughs> John, you're an alright buddy guy, dude. What? He's soft and squishy like a marshmallow. That's funny. He's another soft and squishy. I could pat him on the head. Somebody oh, said they'll give you soft and soft and squishy. What the hell? I put it all now. get out of this place. We don't want to leave. Sounds like you need some Viagra. You never get out. You're always in here. Once you're in, you never leave. Well, actually, they don't, because they don't know the combinations. Exactly. <laughs> also, if you see someone with their uh, armbands, they're not part of the settlement. They're only here for less than a week. But they're working for me. So still let them in. Just keep an eye on them. Right, ran, ran into a masonry yesterday. Name was Dog. Pretty cool guy. Nice. Part of some cult that wears a yellow helmet. Pretty cool. Oh, nice. Wait, spiky? Yeah, real spiky, yeah. Yeah, that guy's, nice. those guys are cool. Yeah, me and him. Do you know that house right on the right at the back side of the entrance? Me and him yeah. set, up, set up camp right there for the night last night. Nice. He's uh, what you so call? So what are you guys doing? Well, we're about to take down some walls. I, I guess I'm gonna be a fisherman. Hell, I don't know. It's just so much well, to take you here. Well, that's, that's the nice want. thing about it, though, Aaron, is you can do you can do two. You can do fishing, the fishing thing, when you want, when like you have free time, and then when Sean needs you, you can do the scouting. You know I mean? Yeah, if, if you want to. Dude, Join my ranks, you're more sure. than welcome. I could use people like you. And, uh, there you go, brother. another thing. I have a pair of handcuff and handcuff keys. Do we gotta turn them around? Not keys, no. So, yes or no, would you, uh, do you wanna join? Because I can add your, your name. Who are you talking to? You. You, Aaron. Oh, yeah, sure. But like I said, All right. I'm on vacation next week, so I'll be. That's fine. Away. Dude. We all got real life. What about you? <laughs> what, what's your role? <clears throat> I I am the Blue Cow Public Works head, as well as the head of the Blue Cow Fishing and Farming Depot. You're on a tree slave. Yes, sir. But, when I'm out and about, I'm more than happy. I'm not a very big PvP person, but I am a bounty hunter, so I'm more than happy to assist when I am out and about with the medics. Always. Okay. Yeah. Seven. I just, uh, I just know that my primary duties, my Seven. primary time, are going to be Is that a capital M? Fishing. It's capital K, capital M, capital A. Hey. Oh, so is that a Savannah? Well, there's someone yes. at the gate saying that they work for you. Locky Glock. Yeah, Glo yeah. Oh. Glock. Yep. Yeah, Glock Locky Glock. Yeah. Glock's cool. Alright, Johnny, you wanna go get to work? Standing at the gate for 30 minutes. Uh, yeah, I'm honestly just waiting to hear back from Cosmo. I need some... I need some tools in order to destruct all this shit, so... Well, uh, I have a hatchet. We can at least get started. Right, and that's a... That's a great start. Um, and I also have an axe. Yeah. 
the car now, do you need it. to leave? I'm, we're gates me now again. Um, did you have those Tetra? Because I didn't grab them. Uh, I didn't see them on the floor. Let me message Cosman really quick and just ask him. Hey, bud. Yeah, dude. I think he's taking crap right now. Oh, that's right. Or have you been swallowed by your toilet? <laughs> I don't have no pliers, I would take that wire off, so. But I do have a box of nails and some flares. Fuck yeah. Okay, um, All right. What needs to go down first, cuz? Yeah, and so, like, when we tear all this shit down, I, I honestly, I plan on keeping all the materials because we can do it elsewhere. So. When we do tear this down, I'll end up just like stacking it all on the ground, then we can pick it up with the truck and drop it off somewhere. So. But yeah, we gotta we gotta take down these two walls. This wall and then this wall. Get these out of here. Alright. And we gotta take down Take down um, this big watchtower that's on top. Ah! We gotta take down this one. But before you can take down this one that I'm going up, we have to take down all this shit that's up here. So this watchtower and these two walls we gotta take down. And then for now, um, we'll leave that shit right there in the corner. That that uh, frame and that fence right there in front of us. The yeah. corner there to your left. Yeah. With those boxes, we'll leave that for now. But everything else in this area, gone. All right, man. Well, that's enough pitter patter. Let's get at her. Yeah, it's a shitload of pitter. Just gotta get some patter so I can do exactly what you said. Go at her. But <coughs> I need to figure out the tools real quick. I'll be right back. Hi. Hi. Oh. And, uh, Real quick, you should just come with me. Yeah, look at uh, kind of say. So this is a tool stash back here behind the police station. So there's three little sheds right here that will be spawning tools. Look, there's already fucking. Oh, nice. Well, that's what we need right there. Yep. Okay, here we go. Now we can just beat this whole thing up, bro. Let's, let's freaking do this. I am absolutely stoked at this fuck right now. Let's go. Can I take his cowboy hat? Because I feel like it's more of a suitable thing for me than this here. Northern yeah, headgear. Here, grab these two. There we go. These. Alright, man. And do you have sharpening stones? Yep. Alright, good deal. Well, let's I'm get out here. Here, grab some of these. Some on the bench. These respawn every time uh, the server resets as well, so I'm just kind of grabbing what we need. This is cool shit, own, I'm not gonna lie. I'm full four. Yeah. Where it's at, man. I plan on helping the community out a lot as much as I can. For real. Alright. You ready? Yeah. Good job. I'm always ready to make shit happen. Love you. Like, I had a base on. Keep that. On a, I had a base on official that was almost, yeah. as, bi almost as big as this main street. Yeah, just keep that little uh, that little tool shed quiet, and uh, if you happen to be done with the tools, just go put them back in there if you can. Otherwise, once your tool is red, just go ahead and chuck it somewhere, and it'll despawn. What the hell? Because you'll you'll get another tool. What? What happened to this doctor? <laughs> All right. There's Bradley hung throughout. It's pretty cool.
and uh, I'm gonna drop a uh, sharpening stone right here on the ground. Alright. Thanks, man. Yep, and then go ahead and close this so you can put that apart on the other side. Alright, I'm gonna go up here and start tearing this shit down. Alright, man. Working on the railroad. What up, Cup? What up, Madman Jason? What are you uh, doing? Well, do a little job here. Tearing down all the building structure in here. Because we moved headquarters. You need him? Okay. Just give me one second. This is no longer a gate, so I have to take a slower part down. So yeah, what are you all about? I need to build a gate for my house. Oh. Uh, let me take you to talk to somebody. Follow me. Uh, hey, Johnny. Hey, Johnny. There's somebody here to talk to you. Yeah. I'm going back to work. Okay.
down, chuck it all on the ground, and then gather all the nails from it. And then, um, be ready. Do you happen to know, though, where any, where any extra backpacks are? Hey John, you want to throw me that pickaxe? You want to throw me that pickaxe? I got all the walls down over yep. there. I just need to dig them up. Yep. One second. Um, must be down below on the ground. Okay. Right camp. Yeah, just keep this one in your uh, dealio. Here you go. Ooh. Thanks, man. Yes, sir. Oh, does this guy need some nails, by the way? Johnny? Yeah. Does this guy need some nails? Yeah. Here, I got a box. You got anything to trade? I don't know. What exactly do you want? Do you have a sharpening stone? I don't have a sharpening. All right. Well, you can make it up to me later. Okay. Do you have a fishing pole? <laughs> That'd be nice. Um, I'm sure I'll do somewhere. Kit I could use. Uh, I don't have one, but here's a piece of rope you can make one out of a bush. Thank you, man. Yeah. A nice little pile right here so we can drive by with the truck and just pick it all up. Alright. And you did see those two sharpening stones on the ground next to you though, yeah? Yeah, I grabbed them. Okay, cool. We ain't gonna have the entire supplies because I think that guy grabbed a couple logs. Uh, that's fine, I don't worry about it. As long as it just isn't sitting on
You think he got some wire, or do you think he's gonna lock himself in his house? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I'll, I'll help. I'll help him out. <laughs> <All right. laughs> I've been in a, a couple bounty hunts with him. He's a, he's a really cool kid. I like him a lot. One round of Jose Cuevo. Shit is uh, tedious. Do what? This shit's kind of tedious, you know, but it needs to be done. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Then place all the logs in. Yeah, that's totally fine too. I was gonna say we should maybe space the logs out just a hair so that we can. Like, oh yeah, just, I got like, right you. Here. All right. Did you already pick up all the nails? Yeah. All right. Oh, all right, I'll give this log. <laughs> I'm gonna race you. I think I'm winning. Alright man, well if you want to go ahead and go grab a truck, I'm going to start working on this tower also. Hear me? Alright. Yeah, sorry. What? Oh, you're back with, with Whittle Keen, huh? Oh. Damn, I was hoping you had something my, my stuff.
still got that pickaxe? Yeah, yeah, but I'm using it at the moment. If you give me like 10 minutes, I'll be done with it. Okay. Hey, uh, or go talk to Johnny. He might be able to have another one. Uh. You got a pickaxe? Yeah. Yeah, hold on. Let me. Yeah, just make sure you bring him back, right? That's what I was about to do. I just went up to my house and built Cool. Do you need wire and pliers, or are you good? Okay. So, just so you don't build yourself in, now that you have that, you can bring that back, and then you can also bring these pliers back. Aaron, here's this this backpack for you to hold in your hand so you can fast transport multiple items at once. All right, if you want to sit it down there on the on the on roof. The ground. Yeah. Well, it ain't really the okay, ground. Okay, it's right behind you. All right. This is right behind you. All right. I'm gonna go try and find a truck.
What up, cut? What's going on, man? Nah, just chilling, man. Working a little bit. What about yourself? Oh, not much. I was just looking to see who was around or whatnot. Didn't know if uh, Whittle P was back. Yeah. Damn, so he was looking for some items. I don't know if his store was open. Didn't see anybody around. I don't know, he might be over there next to Johnny.
Hey Johnny. Man. I gotta I gotta get off here, I gotta go to work. Yeah dude. Sounds good. Thanks for helping. I really so, appreciate uh, it. Here's your pickaxe. I'm gonna set it over here Thank with all you. these logs. You, you can just dude just hold that on you for now. Just hold on to all that stuff for now. Alright man. Maybe drop like just a few a few nails, like one stack, and then that should be good. There you go. There's a ninety nine right there. Fuck yeah. Thank you. Alright man. Well uh I might be back on tonight. You gonna be on tonight? Yeah um, maybe late late, but I am having the date night with my wife, so Alright man. Well uh we'll see you. Yeah man, hit me up. Alright.